All right, let's find the greatest common factor for 16 and 35. So the greatest common factor, sometimes you'll see that called the greatest common divisor or the highest common factor. Let's use greatest common factor, GCF. So to find the GCF for 16 and 35, we're gonna look at the factors for 16 and 35, compare the common ones and choose the greatest. That's the GCF. So for 16, one times 16, that would equal 16, two times eight, and then four times four, that's 16. For 35, one times 35, and it looks like five times seven. So those are the only factors we have for 35. So we have our factors, let's see what's in common. Well, one, that goes into 16 and 35 evenly, so that's a common factor. And that's it. This is the greatest common factor between 16 and 35. So in answer to our question, the GCF for 16 and 35 is just one. There are other ways to do this. You could use prime factorization, but unless you have a pretty big number, this works pretty well. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.